What is programming? In this video, I will teach you in a summary what is programming, how it can help take your career to the next level and your business to the next level. Programming is organizing things to solve a problem. We program data to become information. That's it. That's programming. But wait a second. What is data? Data is any idea, object, person, car, plane. Basically, stuff is data. All matter in the universe is data. People, animals, and even ideas, it's all data. What is information? Information is an organized group of data or things in order to provide a solution to a problem or help a person find a solution to a problem. Programming is simply organizing things to solve a problem. Programming happens in three steps. IPO, input, gather as much data as possible in order to be able to solve the problem well. Process, we process or organize data in a way that it can help solve a problem or inform a user to help a user solve his or her problem. And finally, output. We present the information to the user. Step one, input. We gather all the data points we need to solve our problem. Step two, process. We process all the information in order to yield a result. Output, we show the results to the user. Across all the steps in this process, we will be communicating with the users of the technology in order to verify that the product is closely being useful and friendly to the users because at the end of the day, technology is about people, not things because technology solves problems for people. Programming consists of only two tools, which are variables and methods. What is a variable? A variable is a virtual box with labels where you store things, or as we call it in computer science, data. In variables, we can store anything, but remember to put a good title on the label, else you won't be able to find it later. This would be our variable in computer science, and person would be our title. And finally, what is a method? A method is like a cooking recipe. It's a sequence of instructions. They always execute step by step from top to bottom, just like you would read a sentence word by word. From left to right, it's exactly the same way a CPU reads a method. I hope this was very useful. If you have any questions as to how technology can help take your business or career to the next level, please do not hesitate to ask me. Serving and helping people with technology is my number one passion. Have a great day.